Hey, what's up guys? The TechSpot here, and today I'm partnering with Wondershare to bring you guys an iPhone 12 giveaway. So stay tuned, we'll be talking about giveaway details towards the end of this video. But before that, I wanted to talk about their software, which is super handy, it has so many different features. But anyways, as you guys know, iOS 14 is here and it brings with it so many great new features. For example, widgets. Now you just tap and hold on the icon, edit home screen, and you can tap on the plus icon. Whoa, okay, where did my plus icon go? I swear it's not there. Look at this. These iOS 14 bugs, right? Let me go in and close out all my apps. Okay, so now let's try again. So all you gotta do is edit home screen again, and there it is. You get that plus icon. Now there are loads of widgets that you guys can add, and there are even third-party widgets, which I made videos on. So super cool stuff. Now we also get the app library, so it's all the way to the right, and it organizes all your apps into these folders automatically. So you have games and all that stuff, entertainment, and it also goes to search for apps right here. But anyways, it just keeps your device very organized and uncluttered. Now we also get some great new privacy features. For example, when it's using your camera, so you guys can see now it's using my camera, it shows a green dot up there so you know that it's using your camera. And when it's using your microphone, you guys can see if I bring up Siri, it has an orange dot that appears as you guys can see right there. So Siri is using my microphone. Now Siri also does speak full sentences more naturally. For example, here we go. Who is the fastest man in the world? Watch this. The world's fastest man is Usain Bolt. With an average speed of about 23.4 miles per hour in the 100 meter dash at the 2009 World Championships in Athletics in Berlin. Okay, so there you go. Usain Bolt, 23.4 miles per hour. Jeez, that's quick. But you guys heard how Siri does sound more natural. There's also more voices I could choose in the settings. iOS 14 does focus a lot on privacy, as you guys saw with the little dots up there. And so much more in Safari. You can even go and tap on the double A's and tap on privacy report to see everything that's going on. Trackers, what they're tracking, and all that good stuff. All in all, a great update, but it does not come without its flaws. So you guys just saw what happened over here with my Plus not showing up. And also, I have this iPhone in the back of my head. Notice that's come on turning on and off. And that is because of iOS 14. This is the iPhone 6S and it is heating up. So I'll be showing you guys how to fix any issue using Dr. Phone. If you're still having issues, this was just in a reboot loop. It kept on rebooting, going to the Apple logo, booting up, and then it would just die and turn off again. And they would turn back on and keep on going in the same cycle. So if you are having any issues with iOS 14, here's how to fix it. So step one, plug your device into your computer. Mine's already plugged in. And once you unlock it, if it pops up with trust, tap on the trust pop-up. God, this phone is still heating up. It's pretty hot. Okay, anyways, it's plugged in. And I'm going to go on my computer now. And I have over here Dr. Phone. As you guys can see, I just have it open right here. And the link will be down below in the description. And it has so many features. For example, we've got data recovery. We've got a phone manager. WhatsApp transfer. So you can transfer all your WhatsApp messages to another phone. And then you have the screen unlock, which I'm not sure if this works. We also got system repair, which is what we're going to be focusing on. we got phone transfers. Again, you can transfer all the data from your phone. we got a backup. Virtual location, which I did make a video on, allows you to spoof your location. Make your phone think that you are in a different area. So, for example, if you want to trick Snapchat to thinking that you're in, I don't know, the Bermuda Triangle or even the middle of the Pacific Ocean, you could do that with this. So, I'll link that video down below in the description. And there's also a data eraser so you can erase everything off your iPhone. And, for example, you want to sell your iPhone. Anyways, we're going to be focusing on system repair for this video. And once I click on it, it just opens up that tool specifically. And you guys can see there is also an advanced mode. So if it doesn't fix the issue with the standard mode, you can use the advanced mode. But anyways, this fixes over 20 iOS problems, including the black screen of death, the reboot loop on the Apple logo, which is what I had just a second ago, and also when your phone is stuck in recovery mode. Basically, any issue your phone is having on iOS 14 or basically any other version of iOS, this will fix it. So let's go ahead and click on this right here. And what it's asking to do is turn off the device first. So I'm going to pick up my device and let's go ahead and turn it off first. And it'll bring you instructions on the screen on how to do it. So let's turn off my device normally. And now it's saying for step two to hold down both the home button and the lock button at the same time simultaneously until you get that iTunes screen. So let's go ahead and do that. So I'm just going to hold down both these buttons. And we get the Apple logo. Don't worry, just keep on holding down on both the buttons. And again, we just keep on holding down until we get that iTunes screen. So keep holding down. This might take a little bit of time. Let's be patient. All right. Okay, we're still going. And now it's booting back up with the Apple logo. And we should be at that screen. 
here in a second. Boom, there you go. And now it pops up over here in Dr. Phone. I'm gonna set my phone down. And over here, you can see all the different software files that are available for you to update or downgrade to. So for example, if you were having issues with iOS 14.0.1, you could downgrade to iOS 14.0. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so I'm gonna click on 14.0 and let's go and click on start and it will go ahead and download the software, downgrade you to whatever software that you selected. So all you gotta do is leave your phone and computer alone now and let the software doctor phone do its magic. Okay, so you guys can see it pops right here. The firmware are ready to complete. All you gotta do is now is click on fix now. Just leave your computer and phone alone. It gives an estimated time of less than 10 minutes. And you guys can see for me, it does say repair failed. So let's go to the advanced mode and see what this could do. So this will erase your device. So make sure you do backup your data. Uh, let's go and do 14.0.1 because that is more stable, but I just want to show you guys that you can downgrade, but let's do 14.0.1. So start and now it's downloading the software file. So you guys can see no matter what issue you have on iOS, this will fix it. If the standard mode does not fix it, then the advanced mode will. And all right, so it's just about done. Now it's verifying the firmware package. And again, I'm not doing anything. All I gotta do is just sit here and wait and let the software do its thing. Now it says the firmware is ready to complete. Let's hit fix now. And yeah, so all you would have to do is click on fix now and then you're good to go. Now for me, I think my device is already good. So I'm just gonna go back and click on exit recovery mode. I also wanna show you guys this feature right here. So all you gotta do is click right there and watch this. It'll exit my phone out of recovery mode after I click exit recovery mode. So you can see now my phone is exiting recovery mode. Boom, the Apple logo pops up and we are back in our device now. Okay, whoa. Okay, my phone had calmed down while I was in recovery mode and now it's not heating up anymore. Let me go and see how it runs now because before it was kind of choppy and it does seem more smooth now. So yeah, okay, it definitely does seem more smooth. So yeah, I think that issue is fixed. I don't think I need to fully restore it. Maybe let me go and check my battery health. So I'm gonna go down over to battery and the battery health on this phone might not be the best. Yep, it's at 80%, doesn't need to be replaced, but it's still working fine now. So this is really, really cool. So Alka top library and yeah, no matter what tattoo, it's not dying or restarting or rebooting. Cool, let me try to go through different settings. I went to accessibility and then I went to display and text size to turn off my auto brightness because it was acting goofy and now it seems to be working perfectly fine so whoa that is way too bright now but let me go in oh yeah it's weird swiping up in the bottom for control center because i'm used to it being on the top right but yeah guys looks like this phone is good to go now awesome and all right guys now for the giveaway the iphone 12 giveaway it's always great to give back to you guys for sticking with the channel and being a part over here so i'm super excited to partner with wondershare to bring you guys this iphone 12 giveaway because i know you guys love giveaways and it's the iphone 12 it's gonna be an amazing device cannot wait so how do you enter this giveaway so before i start this giveaway does end on october 20th so super close guys we literally have like five days and then the giveaway ends. So it's going to be super, super quick. And the winner is going to be chosen. So then once the iPhone 12 is released, Wondershare will be sending out the iPhone 12 to the winner. So super exciting stuff. Again, the giveaway is going to be ending on October 20th. So make sure they enter quick. So how do you enter? Well, first step is to like this video. Just smash that like button. And then on our computer, what you want to do is open up your internet browser. By the way, look at all these iOS 14 features. Super cool. Anyways, you guys can see over here, we have the giveaway. So before we get into the giveaway, guys can see it says, join Dr. Phone worry-free iOS update plan. Win new iPhone 12 for free. Exclusive 40% off chance to get Dr. Phone iOS system repair tool, which will fix various iOS 14 update problems without any hassle. And again, has loads of other features as well as you guys can see over here. So it's definitely worth it. 40% off. So they're having a huge deal going on. And that is why they're giving away this iPhone 12 as well. So anyways, if you do want to get Dr. Phone for 40% off, that promotion is running right now, but it will not last forever. Anyways, scroll down for the giveaway, and it's right there. So update to win an iPhone 12. It's completely free to enter. All you got to do is answer, when will you update your iPhone to iOS 14? So I already updated to iOS 14, so that's when I would select, or you could just choose any one of these. It doesn't really matter. And there is a beautiful iPhone 12. All I got to do is type in her email. So there you go. I just typed in my email and don't worry guys, I'm not going to win. Okay. They already know my email. And anyways, you can also get in like it right here and share this giveaway. But anyways, to enter, just hit submit to get your new iPhone 12. 
and boom, just like that, submitted successfully, and that's it. You can download Dr. Phone for your Windows PC or your Mac. It's available for both operating systems. But yeah, guys, that is basically it. All you do is hit that like button and then enter your email in the giveaway, hit submit, and you're golden. Again, the giveaway winner will be announced on October 20th, so make sure you stay tuned. If you do get an email from them, then that means you did win. And your brand new shiny iPhone 12 will be shipped to you as soon as it's available. So guys, I hope you are excited as I am for the iPhone 12. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button. Also be sure to share this video and subscribe for many more videos. This is your text bot and peace out.